G'day you donor. Are your wagon owning friends sick of you sneaking empty cans in their wheel bin bag? It might be time to sort that problem out before they stop inviting you on their trips. Hi, I'm Alex. This should solve your problem. The Grab Me Gear GearMate 58 Ute Bin Bag. The Ute Bin Bag takes the same quality and features from our wheel bin bag and adapts it to a clever mounting system for a tailgate. Now looking at the back, you can see we've got three straps. All of these are UV stabilized polypropylene to reduce fading. There's one, two, three Grab Me Gear quick release metal buckles. No plastic here, so they're never gonna get brittle and break. So fitting the bag is easiest with the tailgate up. You got this carpet on the back here, that's nice and soft, so it's not gonna scratch your tailgate. And you just take these straps, pass them over the tailgate, down the gap at the bottom, and clip it up with the buckles. There's even a little strap keeper on each to keep them all tidy. The first time you set the bag up, you'll have to tension the straps so it'll take a little longer, but after that, it just snaps on and releases super quick. You can leave it in place, close your canopy doors, no dust gets past the seal of that still, and when you drop the tailgate, it just stays in place. Mind you, that's not exactly useful when you want to have it around camp, so if you just undo this middle clasp here, now it freely swings, you can lift the lid and put whatever you want in there. In fact, feedback from most of our customers so far is that they don't even use the middle strap anymore. If they're going for really rough and tumble wombat holes, four-wheel driving, they'll do it up to keep it nice and steady, but just for everyday touring and pretty simple tracks, it stays where it is. Something that is worth noting is that if you use one of these tailgate storage units, the bag is going to interfere with that. And we do also get a lot of questions about will it fit wagon tailgates like 80 series, 100 series, 200 series, and unfortunately, no. The internal capacity of the main bag is just over 50 litres, and you have an extra pocket on the front here. You might want to put empty wine bottles in there so they don't rattle or smash, or it could be used as a quick easy access home for the snatch strap. Once you're ready to empty the bin, you just undo the zipper, pull the bottom flap down, and you can take that whole liner out and empty the bin. This removable lining is unique to the Grab Me Gear bin bag. It's 680 GSM truck tarp material, so it's really tough and it's waterproof. You could even drop this out and use it as a standalone base camp bin and then just pop it back through the top of the bin bag when it's time to move on. The zips are lockable all around. The top zip and this zip here, both protected by a storm flap, and if things get a little bit juicy inside, bin juice, just go down the bottom here. You can crack that zipper and let the juices flow. Around the outside, we've got 3D rings attached to the bag. You can use these to put a cable security lock through if you need to, or you can hang a few items off of them. And finally, this bin bag is all Aussie made. Yep, designed right here in Perth, made in Rockingham, Western Australia, using defab canvas straight out of Victoria. So you can feel good buying Aussie made and supporting small business. Well, I'm gonna grab my gear and go. Oh, you ute owners, make sure you get down, follow that link in the description, grab yourself a ute bin bag, and show those wagon guys how real four wheel drivers rock a bin bag. Catch you later.